Amina. I stand before you a statistic. In my life, there have been many hurdles and complications that have made me the woman that I am today. I was an abused child. Who better to understand what a child goes through than someone who has lived it and survived? People have choices, but many people make choices for their children without who have any underlying knowledge of right or wrong. Hello, my name is Amina Dickerson, and I want to make a difference. I would like to tell you several reasons about me that make me a valuable asset to your company. I am altruistic, enthusiastic, and dependable, and I am organized and efficient. I say that I am altruistic because the young age of 16, I dropped out of high school to raise six godchildren of mine whose mother had just up and left and their father was a drug addict. I maintained four jobs to support them in every possible way that I could. Sac sacrificing is something that I know a lot about. Three years later, the state took them from me and gave them back to their mother. I had no say so in the matter as I was not a legal guardian. Several years after that, I was in a grocery store and I met a family while I was at the cashier's counter ready to pay for my grocery items. And I met them, and it was kind of interesting how I met them. They had a cart. There were maybe two handfuls of things in that cart. But I could overhear the man saying, let's just run. Just, just take it and run. What do you think? Can we do it? And I could hear them whispering, and the woman's like, no, 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 don't do that. We need you. You don't want to go to jail. I finished paying for my items. Before I was able to push my cart away, I took a step back. And I had to think about the situation. So I went up to the cashier and I said, you know, I, I completely forgot my friends were behind me, so I'm going to go ahead and pay for their items too if you don't mind. Of course his family is looking at me like they are completely shocked. Keeping in mind, they had probably four or five young children with them. So my heart already was bleeding for them because of the situation I had already had with my godchildren. I helped them pay for their items and I walked them out to their car. I gave them my phone number and told them if there was anything else that I could do for them to let me know. So they gave me a call, probably about two years ago. It was uh, just after Christmas, beginning of the new year. Seems the husband had lost his job, the wife wasn't able to work, their youngest child was severely ill, and they were about to lose the house that they were living in. It was a blessing for me because it was just after tax time and I still had all of my tax return. So I Western Union him my entire tax refund check, which was about $1,500, but it was the least that I could do. I am an enthusiastic and dependable person. No matter where I am or where I go, I'm always 15 minutes early. I do what I can to help out wherever help is needed, usually without anybody ever asking me that they need help. Just kind of assess the situation and ask somebody, can I help with something? I started working at the young age of 15. So, keeping that in mind, I've never called in sick to work, never showed up late, never went home early. I was always there, always ready to do whatever needed to be done. I find myself to be organized and efficient. The last employer that I had, I was able to take a store that was only grossing about $35,000 a month, and I turned around and I made that store gross $90,000 in a month. My employer at, pulled me aside and asked me how I did it. And I told him I organized the store. And in doing so, made it run more efficiently. Because of that, I was assigned the task of organizing and remodeling interior stores, six other interior stores, which also profited the company. A total in a month was about $73,000 increase. The reason for that is because I set myself standards very high. I don't set them too high that I can't achieve them, but I do set them high for myself and for what it is that I'm doing. I try my hardest to complete all the tasks that I set in a timely manner and very efficiently. Here is a copy of my references. Now that I've told you about my altruistic demeanor, the enthusiasm and dependability that I have for life and those around me, and how organized and efficient I am. I know with my skills, training, and overall love for the people that I am the perfect fit for your company. And together, we will make a difference.